What's good, boys? I figure I'd have to make this video at some point because you guys are all Sherlock Holmes and figure stuff out somehow. It's also the third time on this channel alone that I've had to make a video like this. That's kind of an L, I'm gonna be honest. But yes, uh, Kaylee and I are not together anymore. And I know that's sad. I know you guys are gonna roast me about it for the next four years. Bella was literally almost four years ago. I still get that comment every day. But I get it. Like, I'm not even mad at you guys because that shit's kind of funny. And, you know, I just ask you to empathize with me on this point alone. Imagine any tough breakup you've been through or any girl you've been with. Now imagine that portion of your life was projected to hundreds of thousands of people. So everything you went through, good and bad, was vicariously shared with a lot of people. I would not trade my life for anyone's. I'm serious about that. I think I have a top five fan base on YouTube. 1000%. But just as we proceed through the next couple of months, I ask that you don't give Kaylee a hard time. She's still a great person. It wasn't some crazy, horrible breakup or anything. But you know, this is, li this is life I signed up for, so it's all good. If you want to make jokes, that's funny. But harassment, real stuff, that's not cool. I won't get into the politics of it. It is unfortunate, but um, I will say I'm happy that I'm doing better than I was with the Bella one. And that's not comparing the relationships. I think I'm just more mature now because I'm older. Dude, nothing hits harder than getting out of a relationship when you're like anywhere from ages like 13 to 19. I don't know what it is. You'd think when you're older, it'd be worse, but I don't know, dude. I was like traumatized after the Bella one and you guys are clowning the fuck out of me. And that was tough, dude, actually tough. I wasn't gonna be a little soy boy and like tell you guys to stop clowning me, but that was not a fun, I would say month, that was not fun. But me and Kaylee have actually been done for about a month and a half, two months now. Hopefully you didn't notice anything different on my end. Hopefully you saw the same energy always see and that'll never change i promise you that but it's too bad you guys won't see her in videos anymore uh i know you guys like there is a lot of fun but on the bright side i'll let you in on some cool stuff that's happening now and this is no offense to kaylee but i couldn't really move out of michigan when i was with her because she had to finish up her degree and also find employment obviously that's just real world stuff but now i, I kind of have free reign so don't quote me on this but i am really really trying to move out to la for about a year in a perfect world, it'd be so cool if I could have a place in LA and then some of the other really fun Madden guys could come out. But imagine if I could get Vic, Throne, RBT, K, TD, T everybody. I know I missed some names. But imagine I could get everybody out and we could do some fun in real life football, actual videos. The Madden community needs some real shit. We are in primordial stages. The shit 2K guys are doing is nuts. And we have that potential too, but we just got to get there we're in baby stages right now so me and luna are hopefully gonna be in la within the next three months i'm really excited to start that chapter of my life also i really want to twitch stream and be good at it and be consistent and ball out on there too i just want to have another really good year i'm sick of the snow man i'm sick of it so a lot of sad stuff's happening right now obviously me and kaylee are done and i'm graduated msu the best four years of my life if you guys are contemplating college please go but there's a lot of exciting new opportunities too so i had to make this video clear the air this is just part of my life now i know the repercussions i'm gonna face but it be like that sometimes boys so at the end of the day i appreciate you guys so much for giving me a life that i would never trade and i really I really do fucking love you guys. Top five fan base. You can't fight me on that. So yeah, I say this a lot. You ever see me out in person or anything, come say what's good. I am always excited to meet you guys. I would never, ever cloud up on you. But that's that. I love you, boys. I'm sorry you had to see this video, but your regularly scheduled bangers will be after this. I'll see you boys in the next one. Peace out.